Hey guys, it's me Robin from MyPinkStamper.com and I thought I would do a really quick video. It's been a while and things are crazy now because of summer so I've decided to start a new series for the summer called My Pink Stamper Summer Series. <laughs> These are just going to be shorter videos, kind of more to the point. Um, you know, sometimes I say they're going to be shorter videos and they're longer videos but I'm going to try to keep it them short and simple and basic and um, Carly comes next week so we'll be sure to do some videos for you guys too, some summer videos, some summer series, just really quick. And I just got back from my trip uh, just a few days ago. Still have a little bit of the Mexico virus or stomach bug thing that I got from uh, my body wasn't ready prepared for some of the water I drank. And I know everybody warned me, don't drink the water if you're not used to it. Um, I drank the water in like a orange aid Kool-Aid kind of thing and I wasn't thinking so I'm much better today um, so I'm trying to get back in the swing of things I've got a lot to do for my pink stamper stamps and uh, for the cartridges that I work with from Promo Craft so I have a lot to do and I have a lot of fun stuff to do with my kids this summer so again that's why I'm starting the summer series today what I'm going to show you is I just got in the pink end caps for my Imagine machine and I know they'll be coming out with other colors that you'll be able to pop in. So I thought I'd give you a quick demonstration on how to install them. They're super simple and I know Provocraft even has a video on how to you know put them together. So I thought I'd show you how I'm doing putting together mine in my pink uh, studio. So let's get started, let's do that and then watch for more videos coming up. Not today, but soon. Alright, here's my Cricut Imagine and here's the box that my goodies came in. And so I'm just going to show you how easy it is to do. Just pop the stuff out. It's all ready to go. And this is the pink color and it's on Cricut.com. I'll have the link on my website, the direct link. If these are still in stock, sometimes they go really fast. But I'm sure they'll get more in because they're going to be very popular. Especially with me and my viewers that like pink. Okay, so let's start with that one. Now this is, whoops, this one is very simple to do. This is magnetic. So all you do is open this one up right here. Open that up and just kind of, I just pull it up and pop it out. See that? See how easy that was? And then to put the new one in, this one I just put in. I just popped it in like this. Look at that. And ta-da! Look, I almost have my pink Imagine already. So exciting. Okay. Put that aside. Now above here, now you can turn it over, but you don't want to scratch the top of your Cricut Imagine. So if you do turn it over and do it upside down, make sure you do it on a towel or on the carpet or something that's not going to scratch the surface of your Cricut Imagine. Underneath here, there's like this kind of rubbery strip. Just pull this out. It just pops right out. And you want to save this because you'll need it. Okay, I'm going to take these two screws. And I might need to get in closer. I just don't want you guys to see the top of my head. Okay. And then screw them. You don't need to see me unscrew. You're going to get the point in just a minute. Unscrew. Remember, this is a quick summer series video. So I'm going to show you one side. And then the other side I'll just do on my own. Alright, now to add these, if you turn them in the other way, there's an L on one side and there's an R on the other. So that would mean this side would be my right side since it's upside down. Okay, so what we're going to do is simply push these buttons here or push the little and then kind of pull it out and it comes right out. That's super easy. And then to slide it in. Just slide it in and then you push those in and then you add your screws. So I'm going to do the other one on the table so you can see it. I'm going to re-add the screws and show you what it looks like. Okay, I have my screws in and now remember the little plastic piece that we popped out. We're just going to pop it right back in. One, two, and three. Okay. Okay, here's the second side and I have it on the table now. And I'm going to show you a kind of a closer look. If I can, just pop these out without jacking up your machine. Okay, just pop them out. 
and then unscrew. Remember I told you that? And then unscrew and then repop it in. And then I'm going to show you what it looks like when it's all put together. Okay, so here I am with my new pink Cricut Imagine. Now my Imagine's not new, but the end caps are new. So they will be available in different colors. I'm not sure of the colors. Carly's hoping for purple. Cross your fingers. Um, I'm sure there'll be a Cricut green. I don't know what other colors there'll be. Maybe blue. Um, just keep watching Cricut.com to see when they come in stock. And uh, these were available, I believe, for $19.99. They're normally $20 something. They were on sale when I saw them. Uh, <laughs> um, just check Cricut.com and check in the products. If you want the direct link, go to Cricut.com. Or <laughs> if you want the direct link, then go to MyPinkStamper.com and look for this post. And I hope you all have a fabulous day. Have a great summer.